Alright, so on stream we have... Oh, actually we have Jesus and Miso. That's gonna be a pretty tight matchup. Pretty good game. Jesus and Miso. I think Jesus tends to get the, the better part of this. I think he has a winning record against them. I can see that. I mean, Flood is a thing. Cape is a thing. And just grounded speed is a thing. But definitely one of the things that uh, Mario cannot do as well as other characters in the matchup is cover Miso, uh, Ness's landings as well. A lot of characters can literally just like forward smash. Mario can kind of do that if he like has godlike spacing. Another thing about this matchup, um, just with the players, I know Jesus is a really is a player who capitalizes on people's habits, True. and myself is known for having several bad habits. Yeah, so. spot and stuff like that. Definitely a strong player in Colorado for sure, beating Isam as well. He's a he's a person with our the most important win in the state. So definitely like not a not a weak player by any means, but okay. So that's, this is happening. Yeah, Jesus is definitely a super instinct-driven player, as in he doesn't have a lot of experience. He's one of the he's one of our PR one of the PR members who never got a lot of experience with brawl or anything like that, and always plays from the very beginning, but never focused a lot on. Fundamental, like basic fundamentals. He just like created his own version of Smash 4, and that's what he plays. He plays, he, he plays his own game. And if you let him play his game, then nah, then you're going home. Yeah, let him play, let him play his game, and up Smash City. Up Smash City, and sometimes Smash Smash. That's the mix up. Mm -hmm. All right, so game one, going to a final destination. No platforms, which I guess uh, benefits Ness here. Okay. All right. Opening up fairly strong, just literally just running, not running in and grabbing, but misspacing, uh, outspacing his hitbox and just getting a huge conversion of it. Oh, but then Mario got up, got a grab, just on there. Oh, and that's what I'm talking about. But yeah, definitely Mario not being able to convert, so not being able to cover Misel's like landings as well. And I kind of like using the flood there because he knows that Misel's coming in with an air dodge and not a hitbox. He tends to do that a lot. Oh, but the cape was pretty hard there. And actually getting to uh, grab, shield grab out of the down smash. You only can do it, you can only do it if you get really, really close to Ness. Oh, did you see that? That was super cute. Just like dodging both hits of the down smash. That was great. Smart wait there to not get flooded into. Oh, but that does it. Wow. Okay, so what do you think? How do you think Asus can get a kill this right now? Well, he was fishing for it there with that forward smash, but... Yeah. Do you think at 90 that'll kill? Not from across the stage. Definitely not. And me... This is just like taunt, like two eyes in the same game. Yeah. Okay. Must be feeling himself. I mean, he is beating our number six in the state so far, so... Oh, but reads the roll. There is Jesus with those great instincts. Pitching the landing. Oh, good stage break. Yep, I mean, if you don't know how else to get this, the stock, you can always go for it. Especially if your opponent is known for not attacking. Oh, he actually he almost got a super sweet setup down there, right there. That was cool, moving the PK Thunder around the cage so that he was able to still hit him with it. Yeah, very smart. But he's still clearly showing that he's done this a lot. He's been here before. And actually, just having a 91% uh, lead against Jesus. Oh, there's the down again. Oh. Frame 5. Frame 5 moves, I guess, break out of uh, at least that. I don't know when... Okay. Okay. Okay, Jesus. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> so that happened. Uh, another one? No. Alright, so Jesus is... I was going to say back, but back throw happened. Yeah. And that's, did he take? He also take uh, the first stock. He also took the first stock with back throw, right? Yeah. Mm. So definitely, maybe Jesus risking a little bit, not like keeping stage control, but staying a little too close to Ness while doing so, maybe. Yeah. I noticed that he got grabbed a lot while he was rushing in. Mm -hmm. um, maybe not ready for himself to just counteract his offense with more offense. Yeah. Which is, 
I mean, Mistel, Mistel, uh, Ness is literally Mistel. Ness getting, gets, does get a bunch of neat disjoints on bash attack and fair and stuff like that. And that will, for the most part, beat Mario's uh, stubby leg. Alright, so game two, going back to final destination. Okay, and we have, I guess, that adaptation on I'm a read your taunt. And that Nair is still trading with the up smash. Wow. Oh, that was, that was going to be super good. As, but again, Mies, Mario doesn't have the greatest of range, so he doesn't get to cover Miso's landings nearly as well as like, like this. Oh, and everybody is. These players are just both going to throw out just cute combos here. I think Miso had. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, where are you saying? Um, but I think Misov was actually trying to catch Jesus with the tail of the PK Thunder. Maybe, probably. I know he uses that as a setup to sort of get early kills. I mean, at 55, you might die from a bat. Oh, okay. Okay. So, uh, we have Jank the game, featuring Kirby and, and Misov right there. Well, I, I guess that happened? 1-1? I, I, one, one. Well done. That that was that was a thing, and apparently somebody else is missing. We're getting a couple of the cues here. All right, so game three. Now we're on uh, Misov's counter pick, and I know I mean I mean FB seem to work with if we don't count that uh, the cape and the flood and everything else. But I know he also really likes Smashville just because of the jank with the platform. I mean. I'm pr pretty sure Jesus knows to not get grabbed by Ness on that platform. Like, never. But if it is an option. It is an option. You can, as, an, as Ness, you can have that a little bit more safety on being on that platform because, you know, people cannot, like, really come up to you and pressure you. They can't push you from below. Why don't we go to uh, Dream then? Mm, I don't know. Uh, I mean, Mario does get those uh, sweet combos, but I noticed that Jesus wasn't going, going for them. He was just opting for that type of stuff, rather than the up tilts and the upper trains. Yeah, I think that's probably because of Ness's quick neutral air. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not that quick. It's frame nine. It's frame five. So I feel like a lot of the times it's just going to be going for those combos. Oh. Oh, I guess Ness also has like a, a really, really like his air mobility is super good. So oh, okay, Jesus. Okay. I mean, I guess why not, right? You have a, you have the percent lead. Oh, that was that was actually really good spacing in the air there. Just. Being out of the range of Nair, trying to get the spike. I really like that. Yeah, so Jesus is having this huge lead after what happened in game one. And he, get, he gets a bounce, he gets a bounce. Oh. And... Oh no! no. <laughs> Jesus messed it up! He's grinning, he's laughing, he's smiling, he's like, that's fine. Okay, but now he's in the platform. How is he gonna get down? Not like that, that's not how you get down. Not against Miso. But I guess PK Thundering is the way you can die. Question mark. Yeah. I will not kill you. Huh, what do you think Misok should be doing right now? Um, not really sure. I mean, I noticed he's getting just kind of his landing spot a lot more, like you were saying. Yeah, he, oh. I think he's being a lot more precise with that, definitely. Oh, but back to the right there, 147, that will kill. Little ten-year-old is not that fat. He he wait, he has some weight to him, but 147 that'll do it. Okay, and, but Miso can definitely still like, he's still in this. He has a lot of kill power in Ness. He has to beat Mario in the neutral though. He has to be Jesus in the neutral, or he can just appear. I, I should not talk. I shouldn't talk. Miso just he's like I got you. I got you. I know what I'm doing. And, and you see, after that stock, the taunt came out again, so mm -hmm. maybe we'll be seeing more of Miso feeling himself, like in yep. game one. Maybe, or maybe we'll see Tonto get bodied. True. But definitely still like super, super even right now. Jesus is being able to pressure Miso on the ledge a, little bit, a bit more, but I feel like Miso is adapting to his uh, advantage state, uh, advantage state way better than Jesus is. Let's see what, what he does here. He hasn't cornered. He has the option. He doesn't have a jump. Oh, but he just whiffs on the trying to catch the in the air. And these are those down smashes. I mean, they're they're good, but I think Jesus is already aware of them when he's punished like three or four in this entire set. But definitely still like keeping it keeping it close, keeping it close. And I feel like okay, Alp smash should probably kill right here. 
at around 99. I guess not because Mrs. Fat. What do you think? Um, definitely on one of the platforms it will kill. Mm -hmm. But oh, is that is that it? Okay, no. How are you gonna get back? Like that? Okay, now he's in the air. He's still cornered. He's still cornered. Misel gets another grab. Puts him in a bad position yet again. Tail. Oh, he oh, gets a roll back to the other corner. Misel just keeping his disadvantage oh. so well. So well. Misel is saying, you're fresher, you're going to roll here. You haven't rolled this whole game. That's it. If I cover here, if I cover the roll with the grab and I whiff, that's fine. But if I get it, you're dead. That was